mainly wanted to look at Min the loss, see why I could have done better in the. On which map? Um. See which ones I sent you. You sent me Circuit Rialto and Oasis. Uh, we could do Circuit Royale. Circuit first. Royale. So what? What do you feel like your your biggest struggle has been recently? Have you had any like pointed out things where you've been like, "This is it, one hundred percent"? Or um, I'd say, mm -hmm. uh, I wouldn't say targeting. Just mm -hmm. more of my positioning with the team. I realized that like, oh, I uh, I think that we're gonna like make this little push here. Mm -hmm. Then I realized that like, oh, they actually went the other way, and so mm. I'd be out of position or. Um, no, like, I think you can see in these replays, I, I get confused a bit, and it's just like, when when I notice that the there's a team spread out, mm -hmm. I, and I know it's like go for the supports, but also look at who's like out of position as well. Mm -hmm. Thing I, I have a tough discerning with that. Mm -hmm. So target priority, and then like pushing with your team, basically. Yeah. Okay. Um. And so, also falling back at time. Uh, and then, I've improved a little bit, but not as much. Okay. So, okay. Like, okay. Um, and then what map do you want to go over specifically as you have one said I forgot. Um, Cir Circuit actually, Rialto Oasis is what you sent me today. Yeah. I would like to go over, um, Circuit first. Okay. And what's your, what's your hero pool kind of been recently? Uh, uh, just the same, um, uh, Sigma, Ryan, and, uh, Winston. I played, I've actually been getting into more, uh, Ramatra as well. Okay. Cool. Um, let's get started. So here we are, Luna. A lot of like foreign character names here. Uh, let's go ahead and move into this first team fight here. Um, so pretty simple stuff. You're playing a poke comp, um, and the enemy team is playing a Genji a recess. It's a little bit different, um, but your general goal here pretty simple. Just poke. You know, look for squishy targets when you can, and just shoot whatever you can. Um, yeah, we'll just speed through here. Screen, screen share going okay? Yeah, it, it's working just fine. Mm -hmm. So, let me ask you this real quick, right? Why do you drop here? Is it okay to drop? Uh, Let's ask that question. Is it okay to drop here? I was hoping just to get that, that burst damage from mm -hmm. my orbs there, just to the back line a bit. Mm -hmm. And, cause, cause I thought I could, you know, I'm thinking I could just like walk back up onto high ground easier also adding that that pressure to Risa as well mm -hmm. okay um i don't think it's a bad idea but i think the execution um hold on sorry sorry i just got a phone call um no you're okay so i think the execution of this is okay not the i think the idea is good but like i just where's your cover dude right i just kind of got nervous out here because like you get speared and then you get headshot by a damage versus Hanzo, like, you're, you're practically dead. Um, mm. So I think that just a small adjustment here, we could just play cover. We could either play the staircase a bit tighter, or we could play this car right here, which is also good. I see team two go. Okay. Yeah, I think I, I uh, uh, backed up into just yeah. main. I didn't so have much cover to use. We'll, we'll see how this goes. But yeah, you, you know, you're just taking a lot of damage here. We back up, so you don't get punished too hard for it. Okay. I just, I don't like this, to be honest with you. Like, we could be doing all the same stuff we're doing from right here, or here, or here, but we're in the wide open. So, you're like, you need to be playing cover better at Sigma. Okay. Yeah, you you, ha you you waste both Immortality and Suzu because of your bad positioning. This is your fault if, for those cooldowns. And, like, again, where's our corner? To the right, right there. Yeah, play it. You're in the middle. Play the corner. Like, these people on your team who die, that's kind of your fault. I'm not gonna lie. Yeah, I, was, I was thinking the same thing here. I was, I was like, oh, could have done something better there. Mm -hmm. So, like, really simple, just play corners. You didn't play a corner, play a corner. Okay, this is good. Like, you're, you're really antsy to get value, is what I'm seeing, right? Like, you are in a great spot right here. Just sit right here. 
right? If they push you, you play this corner right here, you're fine, right? But you're not happy with spamming the Hanzo or spamming the Mercy, right? Like, this is fine. Just stay up here. You give up a really good position, right? And, like, where's your... Like, you, you kind of have a cover. Sure, you have cover, but where's your team? They're all the way back there. They're all the way back here, right? And, and this is good. Like, you can shoot the Anna right here. You can shoot the Mercy. You can shoot this, right? And even when mm -hmm. the Anna is playing right here, you don't you don't need to move closer to deal damage. Your Sigma, you just you just go like, oh, I'll spam you right here, right? You have splash damage. Just shoot the Anna behind the pillar right here. You're you're playing way too close to Sigma. And you're also just you're not using corners. Play corners. Like this is just inting. And then you get immortality and Suzu forced again by yourself. And then your Ash dies, because what are both of your supports doing right now? They're targeting me when, you know, could take out your priorities like that. Yeah. Either. Like, this is, this is inting. Mm -hmm. So, like, our Sigma position, like, you're, this is your range of Sigma. The Zarya beam, you should treat, like, basically a Sigma. It's like, you, you want to play at the tip of your, your Sigma range, right? Okay. You don't really want to brawl too much, right? You can at certain times when you have an advantage, right? When you're winning, winning, you can get close and brawl, but you, you weren't at an advantage. Alright. Now, moving to Zarya here. So, do we play Sigma again for this map, or no? Uh, no. No, okay. So, your Sigma, like, just general positioning, I'm not gonna worry about your, your corner, I mean, your your cooldown usage, but, like, you need to play corners more. You're, you're pushing way too hard. Um, here right bubble usage how do you get the most energy out of a bubble i'd say especially when uh, everyone's shooting or like it's not just story so there i think mm -hmm. I, I i think i used it uh too early mm -hmm. just, but also for... would you shoot a like would you if azaria walked around this corner here and bubbled instantaneously would you keep shooting or would you stop i would just stop exactly so, how do we bait the enemy team into shooting us even when we bubble around the corner? Use DPS. Use DPS? Nah. I th yeah, you just DPS. Or... Yeah, you just DPS. Yeah. Sorry, I thought you said use your DPS. I'm like, yeah, that makes sense. But yeah, you just DPS and you sit. But how do we get the energy? What is What do we need to do to get the energy? When do you shoot uh... a Zarya who's bubbling? Can you repeat that question one more time? Sorry. Yeah, so... Why would you shoot a Zarya who's bubbled? Uh, if she's like tingled out and you know you can like take her out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So we can know we can take her out. Now, what if we baited the enemy team into thinking they could actually hurt us, you know? So we want to bubble before or after we take damage. Not not preemptively. So what you'll see high tier Zarya players do, sorry if I didn't phrase the question perfectly, is like that was a good bubble, you know, save your team. But like, right here, take damage. Take like 150, 200 damage and just shoot. And let the enemy team think they can kill you. And then as soon as they think they can, you bubble. Right? Like here, right? You took like 100 damage and you bubbled. You got energy. Good bubble. Let me double bubble the dragon. That's fine. And then we're just kind of cleaning up here. But yeah, the big thing for Zarya is your bubble usage here. Should we be here right now? No. No. Not at all. I was it, uh, I was thinking it's like using charge mm -hmm. best I could. But then yeah, I, I get pummeled right here by every so. Yeah, and you force immortality again. So where where like this is again anti, 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 right? I need to do something. I need to do something, right? I need to deal damage. I need to get value. Like, you don't. You won the team fight, right? This is an objective based game, right? You play around the objective, right? Mm-hmm. So you should just be up here on high ground, and then you just wait right here. You play this corner. You throw some right clicks, you know, as they're walking up this bridge. And then when they get up here, you sit on the corner, and you farm energy. And you just left click, right? Yeah. But instead, like, we come down here and whatnot. And, like, this isn't a bad play to come down here. I don't love it. But if your team's on board, like, it can work. But, I don't know. Just not the move. Okay, so 
are where should we be right now? Are we happy with where we are? Um, I, no. <laughs> no? Okay. I should be holding that other corner to the right. Yeah, you should be holding a corner. You should be trying to get energy. This isn't bad either, to be honest with you. This is good too. Bad bubble. Could have been better, but it worked out. What do we need to be doing right now, man? It's pretty simple. Just stay in that corner. Play the corner. Yeah. Right? You're in the open. Like, look, how, like honestly, you're kind of trolling this game. <laughs> yeah. I felt like that. Like, not, not like intentional. But like... Yeah, I mean, like, you're not, like, throwing, but, like, you're not playing very well. <laughs> um, now, th those are good bubbles, right? You're Kathy shooting people. Okay. You get good value with your um, you get good value with your grab here, but not because of what you did with the grab. If that makes sense, you know what I mean? Yeah. So it... when we're grabbing people, I would recommend you have one bubble so you could push your grab. Okay. Right, because if we had bubble here, like maybe we can get a bit more value on this on our own. Because if our cast doesn't hit that dead eye, you wasted grab. Mm -hmm. And you use three ults for a no ult fight. So it's really bad. Yeah, corner play and bubble usage here. Honestly, it's the big thing we're looking at. This is fine, spam. Okay, let's, you know, we can go back and talk about these bubbles here. So bubble on the Kiri, you know, track, track ability, she has TP. And then we bubble our cast, we get a little bit of energy. Okay, the second bubble is okay to save your teammate's life. First bubble, like, don't bubble your teammates very often. I'll be honest with you. You rarely want to bubble your teammates. Okay. If your teammate is about to die, you can bubble to save them, or your teammate's going to use an ultimate, you can bubble them, right? But 95% of the time, save bubbles for yourself. Okay. Now, let's talk about this bubble, right? Like, how much damage were we taking when we use this, this bubble right here? So we're purpled, right? Let's slow this down. Right? We're not really taking that much damage. Not really taking that much damage. Now I think we bubble, we get like six energy. Mm -hmm. So we take a hundred damage, bait the enemy team thinking we kill us, then we bubble. Okay. Now, so do you remember when we talked about corner flipping? Yes. Or, yes. yes. Yeah. So it, who controls the corner right now? The enemy team or your team? Uh, the enemy team right now. Right, because this is the short side. And they have long side control. So you need to be backing up, right? Look at how much space they have on this corner. You need to be backing up. I'd recommend on this map that you don't even hold this corner. Once the bot okay. is, once the payload is pushed here, you sit right here. It's kind of like um, Havana third point, you know, that like really bunkered castle. Yeah. And you're just like, all right, you can push the point, but like, we're just going to hold in the castle. It's the, the same idea here. Okay. Yeah, your bubble usage and your corner usage has been really poor, honestly. I think your biggest issue is just you're not playing corners. This is just a, a throw jump or whatever, try and stall. Okay, playing Winston. Okay, we're on Sig, so we're back to Sig. Oh, right, uh, yeah. I, okay. I meant to for the attack. I went to Sig as well. Okay. Like, why are you not playing a corner? There's no reason not to, right? You see this mm -hmm. versus this, but you still have cover, right? Yeah. Like, do you have an advantage here? N no. Why are you brawling? Right? You, this is a throw. Mm -hmm. Right? Just sit right here and shoot the Sigma. But instead we walk forward, rock him, and then now we have no left shift and we're dead. Mm -hmm. Impatient. Anti. Right? You only are allowed to push forward when you are winning. Or when there's nothing there to contest the space, you know? Yeah. Like if the enemy team, like, you know... And just say like you know, don't be afraid to push up to like here if the enemy team is playing here, right? But mm -hmm. you can't push past 
here because the enemy team is here. Same idea. You cannot push past here unless the enemy team backs up. Good target switch. Good try to stop res. This is kind. You're playing the corner. Could maybe play it a little better. Like, why? Yeah, it's... Just sit here. Shoot the Sojourn. Play Reinhardt if you're gonna do this, man. I mean, it wasn't an awful push, but I'm like, just the, the general idea and thing we're working on. Just like, play the corner. Like, sit right here. Don't walk forward. Okay, you got a pick, so you can walk forward. Now you just sit here. Sit in the corner. I wouldn't be playing in this room. I'd be playing the corner where you're at. But, like, just play the corner. Just play the corner, bro. I'm about to scream at you. Play the corner. Yeah, I know. It's... Also, stop Not jumping so much. For gameplay. Yeah. You need to unbind your space bar for a week. <laughs> like, dude! Why? Just... <laughs> Just sit here! You're throwing! You're trolling! You're gonna die! How- you force nano. Oh my lord. By the way, Sig Flux doesn't do more damage on the slam if you're nano. I didn't know you that. I did not know that. Mm -hmm. Like, you're just dead! Play the corner! You're throwing! Mm. Overwatch is just play the corner. Like, if you literally think about every single map, like, this is how every map is defined. Where are the corners? That's how every map is defined. Where are the corners? Where are the high grounds? Okay. We can walk up here, right? This is a situation where they're giving us space, right? They're playing here, so we can walk to this corner. Right? Mm -hmm. We shouldn't be in the open. This is a situation where I want you to feed. But we're just kind of like spamming here. There we go. Now we walk up. Now you stay here. Stay here. Just stay here. Just stay here. Pull your shield back. Shield yeah, management is really, really bad. There. But I'm not really worried about that right now. Like, you don't need to be here. Just mm -hmm. sit right here or right here and spam. You don't need to walk forward. You are demanding so much healing from your healers that you the only reason you're going to win is because of your DPS. That's it. Your healers aren't in the fight at all because they're so busy trying to keep you alive they can't actually get kills. And your DPS are the only thing that are going to contribute because like you're just getting rolled. I guess it's good. Yeah, you know, chase kills, walk up, good. Nice. Right, there's space to take, take it. And then you stay right here. Stay right here. And you kind of get rolled. I think your your team was on point, so your carry just didn't help you, but that was okay. Huge. Okay. Like, hmm. Where could we be playing right now? That is better. Where do we have cover? On the right side. Mm -hmm. Like so. Just right yeah. here. Just right here. Small adjustments, right? You could spam up here. You could even walk up here if you wanted and shoot their back line. I don't think it's a bad play. Uh, I think right now this corner isn't very powerful just because they have this positioning. Um, mm -hmm. It's not bad. It's just you're really getting rolled. Get Nano to get bailed out. Now let's see. We walk past the corner here. Let's, let's maybe went a little bit too fast, right? So do we have an advantage right now? Uh, Team-wise, no. We're down one. Okay, but ultimate-wise? Yes. So Thanks. but over, so overall, do we have an advantage? Yes or no? Yeah. No. Oh. We're even. Okay. I would say. Oh, because, yeah. We're down a pick, but we have two ults, right? Mm -hmm. So can we push? Uh, Yes and no. I'd yeah. say still poke. 
Poke, yeah. Right, we, we only push when we have an advantage. Oh, you get rocked out of your flux. Tragic. Yeah, you just need to hit the brakes a bit more, man. Okay, Reinhardt is all about corner usage. Like, we could have done this as Sigma, right? If we did this as Sigma and then just shot them, that would have been good. Okay, we have an advantage, so we can walk forward. Good. And then we don't go too far. Good try on the pin. We have an advantage, so we can still keep walking. Okay, now we're even, so we need to be careful. We are careful. Good. Yeah, we're not too we're not careful enough though. Mm -hmm. Corner. Where's your corner, man? Right there to the left. No, I mean or, I'm, this I'm, isn't a corner I'm, to be I'm, honest with you. Uh sorry, I, th I thought we uh, rewinded back to um, the other corner behind us. Yeah. That one right there. You know what you have to do in this situation? Sit. As oh, Reinhardt, yeah. you sit. Since you're not playing Sigma, you just have to sit right here and kind of just push the point and you can maybe use the point to push it up a little bit. And then you can do one of two things. You can either one, like go flank unironically, like that's kind of the only way you're going to get value, or two, just kind of sit here and keep point presence with your shield. That's why Sigma is way better on this map, just because you can do that. Because Sigma can sit on the corner and push. Hmm. Don't you dare drop. Oh. Okay, we get a pick. Okay, we're on the Sigma. Okay. Okay. That was fine. I think it was good. I mean, we weren't in perfect position for corner play, but we pushed the Sig. Force Nano Boost. And then we kind of- our Ash gets two picks, and we just kind of get to walk in for free. As long as you don't die. I like this. This is a big pin. That was good. Nice. I think you played that fight okay. Uh, let's see, like, go from the top. I'm just kind of speeding through this, because... Like, yeah, this I is good. I think this is a moment where, where I, I, I didn't think about where my team was position-wise. I like this pin, actually. Mm -hmm. like, oh, this I, is... I, I, I agree. I, okay. I really like this. But it was just, like, after this. I, yeah. I think I should have just fell back. No, I think so you just... stay, like, here, honestly. Like... Your team just gets picked. I mean, what can you do? They get bobbed and your Ash gets two kills. I mean, like, you're doing what you can, you know? Mm -hmm. You're a close range hero. You need to get in close range. It's just your team Your team gets rolled. What's up? Uh, 30 minutes? 30 minutes? Yeah. Okay. But yeah, you just didn't play corners. That's honestly why you lost this one. I mean, like, sure, like, you know, your bubble usage was poor. Um... Mm -hmm. But, but, like, your positioning was atrocious, to be honest with you. It was really bad. Um, we just need to be playing corners. Um, quite simple. We play corners, then we can get into the fun stuff. Okay. Uh, let's go over Oasis. Let's look at those basics. Yeah, I mean, it should be... You should just be thinking... I copy-pasted Oasis, not the fucking... Like, that. let's see... Uh, but yeah, I mean, literally in your, your games, like, when you self to yourself, you just, like, speed through, like, do what I did two times. Like, now that we kind of know what we're looking for, like, we're just gonna go, like, speed, 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 speed through. Okay, positioning. Positioning. Is our positioning good? No? Yes? Right? Should we do our... Are we playing a corner? No. Okay. So we're gonna do a little, little process here, right? Mm -hmm. Speed through this, right? Are we playing in a good spot? Um... Uh, oh my... I don't think if, so. If I went... Because the Ryan's backing up. So right here, this is a good spot. Good corner play. You get a check mark, right? This team fight, you get a corner mark. We back up, play corners. You do really well when you play corners. Playing corners really well here. Okay. Get hacked. Okay. Push up. Good. Okay, we're playing a corner. Okay, corner usage. Pretty good, right? So, another check mark. Just keep speeding through. Uh oh. Alright, let's see what happens here. How does our brig get picked? 
We push up, get these kills. You back up. Hmm. Why do you back up? I thought the... I was... Uh, I was guessing that the Tracer was just going to keep going in. Mm -hmm. and honestly, now I think about it. They actually, no. Uh, for a second, I thought the revive was a recall. But I thought the Tracer was going to go in, so I was going to get like a cheeky little... little Is it your job? Back, back lines. No. So, don't. Right? This is peeling. You're peeling, essentially. Remember how the first time we did trade backlines, right? Peel. Don't peel. So, what, as a result of you walking back, the Reinhardt gets to walk in for free. And then, now you have to back up even more. Okay. Uh. So, yeah, you, you didn't need to back up, honestly. You could have held that corner, right? Like, again, it's like, you know, don't push forward, but, you know, if the, the team fight's going to take place here... Anything. Fine. Oh, all right. So now we're playing corner here, and like your Briggs dead, your Moira gets hacked probably because she doesn't have fade, and then yeah, it's kind of over. So you you still need to give up space. So corner usage, how do we think we're doing? Put it right here, I'm using that right side. Yeah, good. This is, you're playing this well, in terms of corner usage. Ooh, your brig bails you out. Yeah. Nice shatter. Don't mind you cleaning up with it. We used a lot of ults though, kind of sucks, but... This is a moment where I realized I'm not with my team at all. They're playing main. Mm. I honestly, I, I thought they were following, but I didn't look behind. Yeah, you should just, you should be leaving. I mean, your corner usage is good, but like, yeah, you fucked up. You just need to be playing with your team. Look behind you. I mean, if you saw them. All right, let's talk about this pin, right? It gets us to a good position, but I think it puts us a little too far. Because then, who's going to hit your kit, your fucking back line? The <laughs> nano grind right there. Yeah. So, I mean, you probably could have maybe stopped him from walking in here, but, like, you know, where's the team fight going to take place if you go through here? Right there in that corridor. Right here in this corner, right? So play on the team fight corner. Anyway, you just do your best trade backlines, but like, their corner usage was not great because we just played in the wrong corner. Mm -hmm. Let's speed up here. Corner usage is really good here. Okay, now I have a question. If the Anna is over here, and your team is over here and the Rhine's over here, do you push the Anna or do you push the Rhine? Uh. And explain to me why. I wouldn't push the Anna right now because I, I think that she still has all of her cooldown. Mm -hmm. Instead, of, like push push the Ryan, instead of just being indecisive like this. Okay, um, I don't think you need to hard push the Ryan because your team's only the tracer, but just routing wise. Now, what if the Anna didn't have cooldowns? Would you push the Anna, or would you still stay yeah. on the Ryan? Uh, I'd push the Anna. Okay, she's on the way back there. Huh? Like you said, the tracer is. Okay. But what about the last fight where the Nano Ryan walked onto your back line for free? What if that that'll happen there too, right? True, but I mean, I I didn't think that she'd have like, oh, I don't know. I it's hard this decision for me whether to you know make sure that the Ryan doesn't get to my back line so easily, mm -hmm. or or to like hopefully just trust my. My back lines to stay alive while I take out his support. So I would just, I would go with keeping the Ryan soloed out. 
and here's okay. why, right? The amount of time it is going to take for you to cross the distance between here and here and the Anna can run away is going to be longer than if the enemy Ryan just walked past you into your team. Okay. You know? So most times, if you have a decision to hit the Reinhardt or the enemy backline, you probably want to stick to the Reinhardt if they're going to hit your backline quickly. Okay. Now, if the Anna was right here and the Rhine was right here, who do we go for? The Anna, because it's, she's much closer than, yeah. than before. Nice block. Oh, you didn't block it. Tragic. I'd say your corner usage was like 7 out of 10 there. Which is pretty good from compared to last time. Last time I was like 3. Ooh, big snipe. Now let me ask here, right? Let's go back, right? Where is... So you walk up here and you don't see the enemy run. Where can you be afford to play? Where, where are you allowed to be playing here? Uh, up to that, uh, that front little fence there by yeah, the palm tree. Exactly. Right. You should be playing by the front fence. But instead, we're in the open, and we're not even playing cover that well. Okay, we're playing cover better now. But yeah. I think you could have been more aggressive. Counterpin those, by the way. Don't give up space. Sure. Because see how much space their team gets to now, like, walk in? Mm hmm Right? And, like, the Reaper takes your soldier's high ground, or your Hanzo's high ground positioning away. Right? Watch this. Right? Soldier gets here. Okay. I think we could have been pushing this more honestly. I don't know. Mm -hmm. My point was kind of invalidated by what your backline did, but... Don't peel. Let your team deal with it. Nice pin. Corner usage here, right? Play a corner. We need to be more aggressive on corners, right? Like, you can play corner here, sure. But if the enemy mm -hmm. tank is playing this corner, meet them right play the most far forward corner you're allowed to okay and what's dictated by you're allowed to is your team's line of sight and the enemy team's positioning you know yeah okay okay good corner play like we're peeling we're just all over the place. This so we're making it so hard for ourselves, right? What should we be doing right here? Uh, keeping that corner there. Play with the the dragon. Yeah, just you don't even have to think about playing with the dragon. You just sit right here. Swing, 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 swing. Right, just that's it. Right. Ryan is really good at one thing, and that's stopping people from walking through corners because his hammer does a lot of AOE damage. So you just sit right here and you swing. And that's it. You just swing. Right. It's not your job to peel for the somber tracer. And now you're in the middle of the open, and then look, look what, look what the enemy Ryan's gonna do. He takes open space. Yeah, he he gets to walk in, and now guess who gets to walk in with his Ryan? Their support. Everyone else. Yeah. Yeah. Just play the corner, bud. Play the corner. Right here, like this is all you need to be doing. Right, you can walk up a little bit. Good. Okay. Cool. Summer so hacky, you back up a little bit. You sit right here. Okay. Bad. Bad. They have mobility cooldowns. You're not going to pin them. And if you do, it's because you got lucky. Also, mm. where is the enemy tank position? Right here. Is the enemy tank stopping you from walking on this corner right now? No. Has he been for like the last 10 seconds? Let's see. No, not really, right? Mm -hmm. Where should we be? Uh, up to that fence. Yeah, exactly, Take right? Because where's where does your team? Where's it? Because you play in this little room. Where is your team forced to play? Same, uh, same old, or, uh, same room. Exactly, but as soon as I'm assuming we push out here, watch what happens. We're gonna push out. Okay, we get, this happens, but we push out, you know, really shittily. But look what our soldier gets to do now, and then our Moira, and then our tracer, right? Mm. See what happens when we walk up to this fence? Take space. Play corners, take space. Don't do stupid pins like across the map. You're not gonna pin this person. You're not gonna hit them. Why? Suzu TP. Are you gonna pin a tracer? No. Blink recall. Are you gonna pin a Sombra? No. Recall. Mm.
All right, let's see how we play the corner here, right? The Ryan's backing up. Are we going to take the space? Okay, wait for our team. Good. Good. We walk up here. This is good, right? Because now look what our team's going to get to do. They're dealing with stuff in the back line, so you play slow. That's fine. Right? Good yeah, awareness I, to not push in. I think I, uh, I would have done better if I, if I could hold that fence, though. Yeah. I mean, you could play this fence a little bit more passively. Like, you don't need to be... You don't need to be taking damage when your team is dealing with flankers. When your team is dealing with flankers, you want to be the least burden on your team and just not deal any, right? Mm -hmm. Not take any damage. Uh, but like, you know, generally speaking, you walk forward and your team gets space. Like, good stuff. You play corner. You also pin a lot, though. Like, that's... that's... Okay, let's see what we do here. Corner's here, we're playing the corner, good. Good, I don't mind you walking out, taking a couple hammer swings. Don't worry about the flanker, you're peeling. Stop peeling. Mm -hmm. Like, this, I mean, their team kind of backed up because of Genji, so it's fine. I was gonna say something, but like, just don't peel. Your job is not to peel. Nah, eh, good try. On the pin, on the blade. Now go backline, trade backlines. And use the corner. Oh, you gotta outplay Anna cooldowns. Mm -hmm. But your team gets it. Okay, a lot of things to work on, honestly. But like when it comes to corner play, like that's gonna be the most important thing. Just corner play and mirroring the enemy tank. Right? On the rush mirrors. Like why do we back up here? Do we what makes us feel like where's where's the enemy run? Like right right there at the border where I could be holding. Either exactly. Left or right. So you could hold this corner here. You should be now. Granted, your Moira's not in a great place to help you right now, but she will be in a second. Uh, you get kind of low. Your team kind of trolls, but I think you could have held that corner. You take it back. Good. You stay right here. Play the corner tighter. Stop doing this open space bullshit. Just hold the corner. And if you need to swing, swing. Don't don't play in the open. You're just getting yourself rolled. Right, you have an advantage right now too, so you can be more aggressive. Good pin. Let's see how we do here. Hold the corner. Hold the corner. Hold the corner. Good. Good. I don't think you need to back up just yet, did you? Let's see. You didn't need to back up yet. I mean, I think you could have been fine, honestly. Mm -hmm. Like, low I think key. I was just trying to get the health. I didn't know what my fancy was. I was like, uh. Look behind you. Yeah. Right? Like, you can just do this. Look behind you. But, like, you know, you, you're playing up on this spot here, right? And so. Because you, okay, you actually kill your soldier here. Because you back up, right, and allow this Rhine to walk forward and take this space here, he gets to throw a fire strike and kill your soldier. Versus if you just play this corner and he gets stuck in this area here, he doesn't get to throw that fire strike for free. And he takes a lot of damage to do it. Like again, we're backing up from the corner. Why? Just hold the corner. Yeah, right here. Just sit right here. Do this. I would have died on point to get more stall, but if you don't want to die, whatever. Okay. Walk forward. Good try. I think we play corners pretty well, though. Kind of get diffed. I mean, like, again, just like... I mean, if you can get the squishies here, sure, but there's still a choke point you have to walk through, right? I would just mm -hmm. mirror mirror the tank, you know, just just hit him, right? Give your team space to walk forward, right? Like, is this Junkrat feeding where he is? Uh, no. No, right? He, he's in his prime spot. Exactly, right? And so you're just going to get rolled here, right? Just play the corner, right? We're, we didn't play a corner. We just walked in, right? Even though there was no one there, they met us quickly. Okay. I wonder how this happened. That was funny. 
Alright, like, this is better. But, like, again, like, look at your team comp. They have a junk rat, right? Don't play in this little room. But, you know, whatever. Play the corner. Right here. Okay? Just hold the corner. Don't walk past. Use your shield. Hold the corner. Hold the corner. You're playing too scared. Too scared. A tank. Tank. Do take things. Like, you're playing too scared in this corner. Right? Just play the corner. Sit right here and do what you were doing. Right? Just sit right here. Throw fire strikes. Like, you're not doing anything. And then you get this pin and, like, you, you kill, like, a 1 HP jump crack. Just play the corners. Match the tank. Play the corners. Right here. This is good. Your backline gets rolled. That's not really your fault, is it? I don't think so. No. Like, even here, I think you're playing this corner too scared. Right? We need to play corners and play them aggressively. Like, right here, when they open, we should be walking forward. Walk forward, walk forward. And then right here, like... You're playing this too passively. You're like, I'm gonna. S my hammer swings are gonna be focused towards hitting people here. Your hammer swings need to be focused towards hitting people here. Okay. Right. So you need to be like rounding corner. Like, watch what this Reinhardt does. See this? Walking forward with his swings. That's what you need to be doing. You're walking backwards with your swings. See how he's rounding the corner to get a swing in? And then as soon as he notices that he he he's getting more health than you are, like he just walks over you. Be, ag be aggressive on corners and play corners. That's really all I have to say. Yeah, that's it. I think the big thing today, honestly, play corners and play corners aggressively. Play aggressively. And playing aggressively on a corner doesn't mean like running past a corner. It just means not giving it up for free. Yeah, I think that, that's a big problem that I notice. It's just like, I tend to want to peel too much because I don't want to just like feed my life because mm -hmm. if I'm gone then the rest of the team goes. Yeah. Um, walk to most forward corner. That's another thing. And don't uh, don't get antsy to get value. Just play in good position. Okay. All right. Um. That's, do you have any questions for me? Do you want anything to like go over really quickly before I go? Um, you know, actually, I've noticed in some matches when I I get a little confused when when the enemy team like chooses a reso. Like mm -hmm. I I know like uh, in my head I'm just like okay, just b burn down her cooldowns and then rush her there. Mm -hmm. But like when there's um uh, like really confident people that, who are like equally like balancing out like the reso cooldowns. Uh, when, like, my mo next thing is, like, okay, well, try to go for supports. But then, like, I just can't get past, like, uh, this enemy Arisa. Do you have, like, any tips? Mirror, that I, like, you mirror the Arisa, and you just play, like, Ryan. Like, play it like a Ryan mirror. That's it. You literally just okay. sit on the corner. You swing at her. You use your shield to block cooldowns, right? And then what is Arisa's biggest, like, what is Arisa's biggest advantage versus the Ryan v. Arisa uh, match? Uh, her golden state. Yeah, fortify. Right? And that's yeah. a like 13, 12, 14 second cooldown. Right? And even mm -hmm. then when she does fortify, it's not like she's rolling over you. It's just like, okay, well, I can't kill the Orisa, but I just have to make sure I don't die. Right? Yeah. So, so you just play the corner, swing, 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 and then the Orisa uses fortify and pushes you, and you're like, okay, I'm not going to give up the corner until you, you earn it. And then she walks forward with fortify. You're like, okay, you earn the corner. I'm going to back up. I'm going to give you that space in order to get my health and shield back. Then fortify ends, then you walk right back forward to the corner and kill it. Okay. Right? Just match the tanks, right? Like, uh, you kind of have this dive backline mentality with, like, brawl tanks. Right? And it's really hard to dive backline with Ryan and Rom and Orisa just because you don't have the mobility or toolkit to do that. So you just need to kind of play the front line, win the front line, then go back line. You got to do your homework. You can't skip to the back line. You got to win the front line, then go back line right mm -hmm. uh the toolkit that dive tanks have is that they they never have to go win the front line because they can just go back line but what they give up in exchange for that is they never win the front line fight if they do play the front line they just lose right and then brawl mm -hmm. tanks are like 
I have the tools and the ability to win the front line versus every tank in the game. Um, and I also can go back line sometimes. Sometimes. But yeah, you okay. just need to need to play corners and just match the enemy tank. Don't dive back line as Ryan. It's not very effective unless you know what you're doing. Mm -hmm. um, but yeah. All right. 